I, I think you know without without Bill Belichick ruining sabotaging his, his career, sabotaging. <laughs> He's been sabotaging his career, T. Bill, hey, Belichick don't. I'm saying Belichick don't call to play. Well, like, I don't, I don't, I don't, I'm purposely trying to sabotage him, but he just it just so happened to happen. Like his decisions he's making is greatly sabotaging Mike Jones' career. <laughs> nah, yeah. Like not hiring the OC, it was wild. T. This is down to the wire five one three. Where passion meets sports talk. Tap in. Speaking of gone, I, I know one coach is probably gone. I'm here. We talked about this on uh, off air. Here, maybe gone. Bill Belichick, man. We've talked about this a couple times on here now. Mac Jones stinks too. <laughs> I'll Both tell you this. If they fire Bill Belichick mid season, that is the most that. disrespectful. They ain't doing that. Yeah, they, they ain't gonna do that. Ain't gonna do the, the rumor is uh that they will I'm not sure what they're gonna call it, but he will resign, they'll fire him, they're gonna part ways into this season. And there's already a rumor out there. I'm not sure what team it is, but there's already a team that it's already set up and he's going to it's already set in stone they say i'm not sure the team like i said but it's reported that you know it's out there he's done with the patriots after this season and he know where you're going now, how, I, I do have one ask you, how do y'all feel about on the lag i know on the very last question of the game this past week he benches mac jones for billy zappy that was stupid like bro like bro ain't got no rhythm you just but it don't work. Stuff like that don't work for him in the past. You know what I'm saying? So, not in the last, not in the last, yeah, like, not last, 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 last quarter. But the last possession, yeah, last possession makes no sense, man. It's like it's like he's trying to embarrass Mike Jones. It's like, it feels like that's what he's trying to do. It feels like, it feels like that's what he's been trying to do for Mike Jones' whole career. It feels like he's been trying to embarrass him his whole career. You know, Mac Jones though, bro. Like everybody say, he got like maybe, just oh, yeah. maybe. No. And he could be like, but maybe Bill Belichick's offense is just stale. I'm not a fan of Mike Jones, but it's not all his fault why, why he's like, looked this trash. I would like to see what he looks like without Bill Belichick, though. I'm just I saying. I agree. I would, I would give Mike I'm Jones. I would say it'd be much better, but I don't think he's yeah. going to be as bad either, though. Yeah, I would give Mike Jones. I've seen the throws he's making. Yeah, I mean, he's, he's not good. No, it's not good at all, T. But it also, it, it, could it be impactful on him that he has? This is his third offensive yeah. coordinator he had in this year. His is his third year. Um, the, it's, it's been he has he has no consistency his whole career in New England, which is terrible for a young quarterback. Terrible. Um, so I, I'm not surprised he had he looked this trash, man. Like I, I would, I would want to see him have another chance in, in the NFL as a starting quarterback. I'm not saying I would give it to him if I was a GM out there, but I would want to see him have another opportunity. I don't think it's all right, that's how I feel too. Yeah, I probably wouldn't give it to him if I was. Hey, y'all, y'all so nice. I ain't give it, nigga. No, I mean, no. I just feel like you know he deserves another <laughs> shot at backup unless you know somebody get hurt or something. He deserves another shot. Yeah, man. He, I, I think you know without without Bill Belichick ruining sabotaging his, his career, sabotaging. <laughs> He's been sabotaging his career, T. Bill, hey, Belichick don't. I'm saying Belichick don't call the plays. Bro, okay, but he he, he hires the, the coordinators. Or yeah, last year, like like he did last year, he didn't hire a coordinator at all. That's not sabotaging your quarterback. Like what? <laughs> like, but, what? But, but, but but did he or did he not have Josh McDaniels as, as his OC? Not last year. I'm saying, but his, his, his first year. Okay, but last year he had a special teams coach and a defensive coordinator calling plays for him. T. Okay, then what, then what's the excuse this year? It's a whole new voice in there again. It's like, bro, at this point, I'm pissed off at this guy. Like, the first year we had Justin Daniel, he didn't look that bad. I'm giving the playoffs the first year, didn't he? No, nah, they had one. They had, close, a better, they, close, they, they had a better record. They had a better record. That was first. close. First year he didn't look that bad. First year he wasn't he he wasn't great, but he was looking like all right, maybe maybe Matt Jones has a future in it as a starter quarterback for the New England Patriots. First year, second right. year, the sabotage starts. Bill check. Don't hire OC. Let's a, uh, a special teams guy and did in DC call plays. That's can, wild, actually. I can't, I can't say you. I can't say you. You sabotaging the, the kids. That's sabotaging them, T. That's like, what do you call that then? Because why? Why would you sabotage when you know yo the impact this career impacts him as a coach? The reason why we're talking New England because of the play of Mac Jones. Like, you know, so why, 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 why would you end Joe? Why would you end Joe legacy with the Patriots by sabotaging this kid and and looking bad on your way out? 
well, I don't I don't don't purposely trying to sabotage him, but he just it just so happens to happen. Like his decisions he's making is greatly sabotaging Max Jones' career. <laughs> Like not hiring the OC, it was wild. See, for for a second year quarterback, when you had one of the best OCs in recent history, calling plays for him and designing plays for him, designing offenses for him, his first year, you go you go from that to no OC to a college guy now, Bill O'Brien. I, I get the, I get the OC part, but if y'all watch it, like some of the throws he, and decisions he's making, is is just been flat out terrible. I mean. That, Blown. Yeah, his confidence is blown. He's probably confused as shit now. It's like I said, this is his third or probably fifth voice at this point. Now. That's, that's, more, that's, more, that's, more, that's more on him as a player then. If your confidence, that, that's a, that's the you know, we you. talk about confidence with quarterbacks all, right. all the time. Don't that's, do the, that, 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 that's the you thing. Confidence. If, that's the you if, thing. If you watch the tape of yourself and all you see is yourself throwing picks and looking trash, I'll feel pretty bad at myself. I'll feel better myself too as well. I feel bad. Second guessing his thoughts. People go out there where that, that, you know, that, that, you don't you, watch that's people who play like that's a Bill Belichick thing. That's a you thing. If I'm watching no, play, if I'm watching, if I'm watching highlights of myself and it's looking all bad, I know why. Because man, I remember I, I remember the play was we call that year. I, I had two guys in my ear calling two different plays. And I was confused as shit when I threw that pick. I will feel bad too, bro. I will feel bad if I was Mac Jones as well. So I'm not I'm not blaming that. I, I say it's partially it's partially his fault. That's why I said if I was a GM, I probably wouldn't pay the guy. I wouldn't be my quarterback. Hey, he definitely ain't get paid. I'm saying I wouldn't want to pay him at all. Like not not I wouldn't want him on my team as my quarterback. But um I wouldn't I wouldn't be opposed to him getting picked up by another team and being a starting quarterback for the team. A starter? If the team needs a starting quarterback, I wouldn't be opposed to him getting his, getting a chance, bro. I won't be opposed to it, man. Like I'm saying, saying I, I feel the same way about Justin Fields. I won't be opposed to him going, to, getting chain of scenery, and being starting quarterback somewhere else, to getting another shot. Yeah, man. Because he had turmoil up there too with uh, what's his name? Um, what's the head coach name up there? It don't matter. He'll be fired here soon. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes you just it's those rookie quarterbacks. You kind of got to get lucky, man. If we being honest, like just into the right system sometimes, uh, and so and some quarterbacks work good in every system, but like every quarterback don't good work good in chaos. <laughs> yeah, man, you got a different type of breed to work good. Yeah, it's awesome. like kind of in chaos since uh, well, the right system are most of the time. Right systems are the teams that are winning, and, and not a lot of not all the time. Most of the time, most of the time, you're right though. Most of the time, it is. It is like you gotta have that winning culture you're already built, kind of there. That like, you just like that man, like like yeah. so you like, yeah. down to Houston and just turn turn it around. But he also got a new coach down there, and the whole the whole thing turning around. So it's like you know, a bit different. My boy Tom Brady, looking like he's the reason. <laughs> 